this has potential to go all the way up to the top. Basically, to prove that I'm got the cards mixed up, I'm gonna take a handful and deal them onto the top of the deck from the bottom. And then put some from my hand to the bottom. So now they're all mixed up. And I'm gonna take a third and I'll put it right here. Take another third, put over here and a third in the middle. I asked that my volunteer come up and take a peek at this card here. Cool. Then they can shuffle it as much as they want. But they gotta memorize what that card was. It was Ella Fitzgerald and it was dark. And then, but I'm not supposed to know that. And then over here, they're gonna shuffle these as much as they want. Keep shuffling. And then finally they're gonna come up with the card that's on the top that they wanna memorize. Plus they wanna memorize Ella Fitzgerald from over here. And this one here, two cards they wanna memorize. That's the three of spades. Then we're gonna gather up the cards. Now, I'm going from the top of the deck, which is this side over here, and I'm looking for, secretly, you know, nobody's supposed to notice, I'm looking for the lowest club, and I found it. So I'm putting that down as one find, and I'm putting it face down because we don't want to reveal to the end. And now, our value is eight, so we're gonna add 10 to eight and start counting from here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10 plus eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and lo and behold, 